more time to actually finish it up and work it out. But, um, anyways, I have time now, so I hope everyone's doing well. And what am I today? I'm just going to go over and you know just show what I did in the stream and kind of just talk about my creative process behind it and also you know just saying like hey maybe you should come and join because when i do stream i say a lot of like valuable information for anyone that wants to be an artist or if you just kind of want to dabble or you're just curious and you're one of those people that thirsts for knowledge i myself one obviously um but as i go to pull this thing up so, um, yeah, this is the most recent one, and in this one I just was finishing out some of the fur and finishing out some of the jacket, and then I went over and finished up the whole entire face. Uh, let's see, what else did I do? And before I started this stream, I went and touched up, like, some of the hands and everything, um, because their proportions weren't correct and I wanted to finish because I was still finishing out adjusting the arms making sure everything looked good but um in this episode I did kind of want to go over at least like one helpful detail when going to paint something or actually in any type of art is layering all right, I kind of want to go over in the context of inking and how to layer or how to layer in the context of inking. So, and this goes for painting too. So what I usually do is if I'm using a reference image and I strongly suggest as you improve your artist skills, you might not need to use a reference image as much, but I would at least have some sort of reference image, even if it's multiple reference images, but just to kind of like sink your teeth in and know that if my brain is seeing this and I can correctly proportion everything or get what I'm seeing right correct, because it's, like it's like a guess and check. Basically, that's what reference images are. And then your brain just becomes more assimilated, I think that's the word, to, like, what you see is what you produce. And, like, with this, or it's there, not here, for you guys, um, so if you see something in your mind, it'll be easier to produce it. And you'll say, wait, that's not right, change this, add this. And it gets easier and easier. So reference image is like the number one thing you want to start out with as an artist. Um, so now getting into like how to paint or yeah, that's what I was doing painting because I have a brush and I believe anything with a brush that you use is called painting. True fact. Okay, so going over it. Uh, first thing I usually do is figure out where's the light hitting and avoid where the lightest area is and surround it in a light wash so for me i my light wash was just the leftover ink that got washed in the fresh water or not fresh water anymore but that's what i used to go over because it still had some residue in there of the black ink and that kind of helped produce a light you know fade on everything and then slowly building up putting on top of it and then going through and starting to add the darks in there and I wouldn't say go immediately to the darks because if you go too dark and everything else around it is dark you don't get that you can't tell what your light is and what your dark is it just kind of all blends together and it just it just doesn't look right. All right, so second thing I kind of want to say um, before this video ends um, is that I'm going to be making sure to like post something on YouTube 
for alerts. Um, and I'm going to like try to start getting using Twitter for this, but I've been wanting to do more like live streams of me actually creating art. And if you would like to have a hand in me creating the art, or if you would like to just kind of see and have, you know, see kind of what goes through someone's mind when creating something, I totally suggest you tag along. I'm going to be streaming on Twitch. I still got to figure out that schedule because I am like I have officially started school, so I got to figure out what works best for me. But look for updates. I will definitely try to make sure. No, I will definitely make sure that I am posting and saying, hey, I'm going to go live stream. If you want to come join, I strongly suggest you do. All right. So thank you so much for checking out uh this i want to say remix of it kind of is a remix of a stream without really any music um anyways but i hope you enjoyed if you did leave a like um and if you would like to see more i totally suggest you know not gonna do any plugs here or anything but uh you could totally go subscribe to my or not subscribe but follow my twitch channel um to maybe i don't know participate in me creating this artwork or something else you know i don't know i you know suggest you do anyways thank you so much hope you have a good one